On the next slide, you are going to see our agenda items for today's presentation. Uh, we have been able to hear from Stuart. Again, thank you, Stuart, for your President's report. I think you did a good job of encapsulating the, uh, the current mood that's been around the property. Lots of excitement in regards to the renovation as well. Um, currently, uh, we just did complete our election procedures, and the election is underway. So moving forward, we're going to go over our Vacation Well program, which has been um, the backbone and the ability how we've been able to uh, function and, and make sure everybody can enjoy a safe vacation throughout the times of the pandemic. There's a little bit of history there. And then also we're going to go over some departmental updates, specifically uh, here at the resort. Uh, we'll go over our financial performance, um, which is a very good year, um, good, good things to report there. And then also we'll take a, a, some time to go over our guest satisfaction scores, um, to kind of get a, a heartbeat on our service levels that we're able to perform at property. Take a moment to go over some of the owner benefits that you have as a Wave Crest owner, but also as a Grand Pacific Resorts owner. And then by that time, the election results should be ready. And another quick reminder that we will have our Q&A at the end of the presentation, so please feel free to use that ch chat feature to let the host know that you want to participate. On this next slide, um, you can use this QR code um, to queue up Grand Pacific Resorts library of videos. Um, these include a video on our Vacation Well program, um, as well as other information that Grand Pacific puts out into um, the owner's community. Um, so you can keep up to date on all that Grand Pacific has to offer. I will give myself an official intro. Uh, my name is Joshua Lowry. I am your general manager here at Lovely Wave Crest Resort. Um, I have been the GM here now since uh, March of this year, so a total of seven months. Um, during that time, um, I have gotten the opportunity to meet many owners and um, learn the unique aspect of this property. I want to give a special thank you um, to our very own board president, Stuart Rosenberg, for um, really helping me at the beginning of that process and throughout um, becoming familiar with um, Wavecrest and uh, really the unique nature of this property. A little bit of history on myself. Um, I have been in the hospitality industry for a total of eight years now. Um, prior to working here at Wavecrest, I was the front office manager at um, our sister property, Carlsbad Seapoint Resort, um, which is up in the Carlsbad area. I was in charge of all front house operations. And during my tenure there, I also underwent the uh, Grand Pacific Resort's internal management development program, um, which gave me some, some fundamentals to be able to successfully dive right into Wavecrest. Um, excuse my, my high school picture there that we, we pulled out of the yearbook, uh, which I appreciate. Um, however, I'm very, very, very excited to be a part of this family, and as time progresses, to meet each and every one of you and enjoy um, working here as much as providing you a wonderful vacation experience. Next up on our team is our resort supervisor, Peaches, um, previously known as Peaches Boland. Um, her, she just got married and just got back yesterday from her honeymoon, so she is now known as Peaches Waddell. Many, many, many owners are familiar with Peaches. Um, I have nothing but great things to say about her. She is definitely the face um, of customer service, specifically here at the resort. She also has a very unique role. Uh, she is involved in the front office operations as well as our, with our housekeeping team. So she carries that um, impeccable service, service culture with her no matter which department that she's working with, and we're very luck lucky to have her on our team. Next up, I'll introduce Jean Reyes. Jean is our maintenance supervisor. <laughs> uh, the best way I could describe Jean is a handyman with a smile. Uh, he's dedicated to both the well-being of the resort as well as customer service. Um, Gene came from a background within Grand Pacific Resorts for a total of 10 years um, as a maintenance lead up at the larger um, property, Grand Pacific Palisades. He brings with him a lot of experience um, as well as a smiling face and an incredible energy that's very difficult to match. But just don't ask him what he does for a living because you might – might get more than you bargained for. <laughs> I'll take a moment to go over our Vacation Well program. Um, the Vacation Well program is really Grand Pacific Resorts promise to you um, that we have taken every precaution available to continue 
I should be have taken and continue to take any precaution that we can to ensure that you have a safe vacation. Um, it really starts with our own staff and ensuring that um, they are fit for the job um, and that they are indeed well to come to work. But it's, it's much more vast than that. Um, it really also comes down to our owners. Um, you see here our courteous conduct slide. I will say in the past seven months that I have been um, here at the property, I feel um, that our Waycrest owners uh, really do enjoy being here, but also enjoy socializing and have elected to do so in very safe ways. Um, so we are continuing to ask um, that our uh, that face masks are worn for those that are not fully vaccinated and that uh, a healthy social distancing is still maintained for those that um, are, are still uncomfortable with that pandemic. So associate readiness each day, any associate working will visit the front office and complete an associate screening, um, which consists of a set of questions and a temperature check to ensure that they are fit for duty that day. Um, this process has allowed us to continue to um, provide a very safe working environment for our staff as well. Related to the front office, uh, we are still completing our pre-arrival emails with each check-in. An email will go out and that allows you to complete all of the necessary pre-registration steps um, to ensure that you have a swift and smooth check-in experience. In regards to the guest units, this was where the most amount of effort was put in. Uh, we ensured that uh, all chemicals were upgraded to hospital grade cleaning standards. Um, our associates were trained and certified through Grand Pacific's uh, Vacation Well program to use the correct chemicals and steps in cleaning these units. Electrostatic sprayers are, are still used to finalize the sanitations of the rooms, and then a seal sticker is placed on the door, letting you know that it's our promise to you that that room is clean and ready to go for you. Here you'll see a list or examples rather of the collateral that you have probably seen around the resort over this last year. Um, this primarily was for communication and comfortability with our owners and I think that it absolutely uh, met the mark there um, based off of the standard across all of our Grand Pacific resorts. Um, this collateral was used. Um, currently, um, this will continue to be used in, uh, in a certain capacity as it relates to the pandemic. I'll move now to the departmental updates, um, and I would uh, like to preface this with saying that our department heads have put a lot of effort into ensuring um, that the place runs nice and smooth for our owners, as well as uh, keeping things tidy and neat and ready for your vacation. Guest services. This is your very, very, very first impression of the resort. Imagine it. You've been driving for hours, you get to our beautiful property, and you walk in the front desk, and the very first thing you see is Miss Brianna here, standing at the front desk with a beautiful smile and a welcoming attitude. We focus at the front desk on, on the owner connection and the individual connection, um, and that really that hospitality feel. And I would say that we definitely hit that mark. Uh, this is also a friendly reminder that there is a lottery process um, that is in place um, to help all of the surf owners obtain the weekend unit number that they're looking for. Um, and after this is complete through Grand Pacific Vacation Services, obviously our front desk fields those calls. So, so please feel free to reach out, out to us with any questions that you may have. Our maintenance department, those are my, those are my guys right there. Uh, so in, in that photo, you will also see Tony, who is a hardworking maintenance man. Um, him and Jean are the heart blood of this property um, preventative maintenance program. We also utilize NoCross, um, which is a electronic system that can ticket and categorize all of the things that need to be completed on a daily, weekly, monthly, quarterly, and yearly basis for the property to ensure that we're not missing any essential steps. Our maintenance department also runs our safety program, um, which is, allows all of the associates to communicate safety as their number one priority for not just the associates that work at this property, but for all of the guests that visit. And again, you might work for maintenance, but you work in the hospitality industry. So our service standard is far to none. 
And of course, a personal and fan favorite of the Wavecrest community is our activities. Um, the, this is a list of the activities that we maintain throughout our busiest summer season and that we will continue on. And eventually we will be, of course, adding more activities, but these are uh, a spotlight on a few of them that are what I would consider the classics. We have our wine and cheese social, um, our Monday coffee and donuts hosted by a member of management, either myself or Peaches, uh, which gives the owners an opportunity to talk about their check-in experience and their exciting plans for the week. We also have Sangria Sundays, and the one down there at the bottom, Wavecrest Rock Garden, is a new addition. Uh, we have created a little rock garden where you can paint your rock and leave your mark here at Wavecrest, and we highly encourage you to do so um, because it is growing bigger and bigger every day. As far as our housekeeping is concerned, um, our main goal is to really give you sparkly, clean, beautiful rooms that you feel safe and that you have everything that you need to enjoy your vacation. Uh, we take an additional step with our rooms here at Wavecrest where every single room is inspected by a supervisor before it's released to the guest uh, or to our owners. Um, this allows a second set of eyes to go through and make sure that we didn't miss anything to ensure that you are well stocked and ready to enjoy your vacation. Look at that beautiful shot. This is a great opportunity for me to talk about a very, a very unique program that we have uh, here in Grand Pacific Resorts. We do something called the Be Epic Champion. So every quarter, one associate is selected um, that has shown exemplary service or out of the ordinary uh, effort, and they are picked out quarterly. So you have four per year, and once a year, we select the associate with the best story and the best amount of effort, and I am proud to announce that the BFP champ of 2020 was our very own Peaches. <laughs> obviously, uh, yes, thank you, round of applause. Thank you, Stuart. Um, obviously, Peaches carries that service standard um, that is almost non-comparable. Uh, she's the energy of the property in a lot of cases and really that very first face that you're bound to see. Um, so next time you see Peaches, tell her congratulations. Um, and also congratulations on her wedding. I'll now take a moment to go over some of the resort enhancements that we've experienced over my tenure here at Wavecrest. The first of which I'll speak to is our fencing replacement project. Um, we have completed most of the fencing replacement here at the property. Um, we are waiting for materials for the parking lot. However, this fencing is going to span the pool areas as well as the exterior of the property and the fencing that are, is around the bluff, which definitely gave the opportunity for us to get a fresh and new feeling um, to the property here at Wavecrest. We also addressed some wood repair, repairs um, from termite damage. Um, so during January of this last year, when the property was shut down, we completed termite tenting, um, which allowed us to rid the problem. And we have a phased approach for wood repairs um, uh, moving forward, the first of which was addressed in January, building E. Um, so we were able to uh, start addressing those problems and have built a phased out plan to address it moving forward. We also uh, completed two model units in anticipation of the renovation that actually has started this week. Um, and I want to say a special thank you to all the owners that participated in uh, the surveys that we, we put out. We were able to um, pull some select things between the two and make what we believe is going to be an excellent version of that renovation. So a special thank you for all, that you, uh, all of you that had participated. These are some of our coming soon items. Again, some of these have actually started this week. This is the exciting part. We have a lot of really exciting things coming up um, on our list here. One of which, obviously, on that picture that you see is new bedding, but that is our little sparkling gem at the end. What we are really excited about is going to be all this renovation work that we have um, upcoming and that has started this week. Um, that renovation will include the kitchens, the bathrooms, and then also the exterior uh, window replacements, which we have some slides coming up that will show you some of the work that's already taken place. On top of this, we will be repainting the exterior of the buildings. In the C building, we'll be replacing the Murphy beds, um, which is 
definitely uh, exciting for us here at the property. And also, uh, as spoken previously, those wood repairs will continue in a phased fashion. I'll let that, uh, that photo sink in for a moment. <laughs> Within the first week, scaffolding um, scaled building A and windows were being removed. Um, this is our most exciting project that we have going on throughout the property. And um, we'll, go, uh, we'll go ahead and go to the next slide so you can get a little bit of a close-up view. Essentially, those windows are being ripped out inspected and then replaced with the uh, newest windows that, um, that we have. And I think this photo, this photo right here speaks for itself. Within the first week, um, we are obviously focusing on the demolition, uh, replacement, and the, uh, the windows. Uh, so scaffolding around the building. Obviously, the, the tranquil environment is a little bit of a construction zone, but we're very, very excited to have this work underway. Um, that is a photo of, of the um, brand new windows that are going in uh, pending inspection, so that way we can seal it back up. And this, this little sneak peek of the demolition is going on on the inside of building A. I believe this picture, if I'm not mistaken, is taken from unit number three, uh, 3A. Uh, this is the kitchen and uh, uh, the kitchen area where um, all of the cabinetry and counters were demoed out. Uh, we had a special project shutting these buildings down where a member of our housekeeping team came and packed up all of the loose items, uh, we removed everything from the walls to prep for that demolition team. And uh, this next slide here will show you, obviously, a little bit more of what we have going on in the bathrooms. So same concept, the removal of the, uh, the counters and the cabinetry. Um, obviously, we, you just see an exposed wall there. <laughs> so the beautiful stuff is, is definitely to come. Excellent. Um, I'll go ahead and take a moment to go over our financial performance of this last year. Uh, I want to preface this by saying that Wavecrest is an HOA, um, which means it's a nonprofit. Uh, each year, we budget to have a zero-based budget, which means that our revenue will match our expenses. And if we've done a great job, our operating surplus will be zero dollars. I am proud to display that this last fiscal year, we ended right on budget with $1.277 million in revenue, 1.277 million in expenses with a variance of $241. In summary, we ran right as budgeted and have, a, and have had a very successful year financially. I have also known that owners have had questions on how we are funding the upcoming renovation work. Um, board of directors and management have been steadily increasing the reserve fund in anticipation of this renovation work. Going into this year, uh, we so we have included a reserve chart here to allow you to follow along. Um, going into this next year, we expect to have roughly $1.9 million available to us in our reserve fund. With what we anticipate to spend and what we anticipate to collect over the next few years, we should have a quarter million, roughly a quarter million dollars at the end of the two-year period with this project. Um, this allows us to self-fund this project without the need of any special assessment or larger than normal maintenance fee increases, which is very exciting news. Moving on now to our guest satisfaction scores. Um, this is kind of our opportunity to get a heartbeat on the actual service culture that we do have here at this property. Moving on to the next slide, I will show you here. So below you will have three different categories. You have the RCI Silver Crown Standards, you'll have our internal goals here at Grand Pacific Resorts, and you have the Wavecrest Actuals, which are, are far exceeding the Silver Crown um, requirements there. Uh, I do want to focus on the fact that each guest that comes in, um, especially our owners, are surveyed at the very end, which is how we collect much of this data. Uh, we ask uh, a few questions um, depending on department, um, and we really want to focus on that hospitality aspect. What was your overall experience here at Wavecrest? We're also able to get a heartbeat on any of the surveys um, that we receive of anything that maybe didn't go as planned. Um, unfortunately, in the world that we live in, nothing is absolutely perfect. So 
So this allows us to gather any pertinent information so that we can improve moving forward. And I am proud to announce, obviously, based off of these scores, that we were recognized against the year 2021 for our RCI Silver Crown Standard. I will take this time now to go over some of the owner benefits that are available, available to you as a Wavecrest owner and through Grand Pacific Resorts. Grand Pacific Vacation Services is essentially your one-stop shop for anything related to your ownership. If you have questions regarding a reservation, or if you're interested in banking your week, or if you're interested in exchanging out and possibly going to a new location that you haven't experienced yet, you can call Grand Pacific Vacation Services and they can walk you through that process. And of course, if you end up with any questions, feel free to call the resort too. I'll also like to spotlight our Grand Pacific Exchange Nightly Getaways. The Nightly Getaways is a unique program that we have because it gives you access to nightly rentals that do not require banking your week or giving up your week here at Wavecrest by any means. These are discounted uh, as much as possible and access for the owners um, here for you to enjoy maybe one or two or three nights um, at another unique location within Grand Pacific Resorts. Also, we have Grand Pacific Vacation Services Perks. Um, this is our newest program that we're, we're, we're proud to display. Um, essentially, this allows you to deposit your week into something we call savings credits. Maybe travel isn't necessarily on the books for you, or you just like some more unique options related to your ownership. You're able to deposit your week and transfer them into savings credits that you can use on very large discounts related to anything from rental cards, hotels, hotel stays, or even gift cards. Um, there's also very large discounts on cruises um, and other associated programs. If you have questions or you're interested, please feel free to reach out to Grand Pacific Vacation Services for, for more information. And lastly, uh, please select this QR code if you're interested in the Time Together magazine. This award-winning magazine um, brought to you from Grand Pacific Resorts uh, gives you a lot of inspiration of some of the different places that you have absolute availability to travel. Uh, so if you're interested, please utilize this QR code or feel free to give Grand Pacific Vacation Services a call to get your coffee.